Hey guys, this video is for Tiffany. Really quick, um, she asked, um, it was funny because she said somebody um, recommended me to her, which is great, um, and I hope that I can help. And like I said, told her, so I'm no expert, but I'd love to try to help you. But I think what she's having trouble with is she said that um, she's a Mac, a MacBook owner, a laptop user like me. Um, so... She said she has to hold the command key, which I don't even know how to do that. But here's what I did, and I had trouble doing this too. So whenever I want to use text and I use their free fonts, go down here on the left, and you might see that my um, icons are, like, way bigger than a lot of them. That's because I went into my preferences up here when you click Silhouette Studio, and I made my buttons as big as they could be because even though with LASIK eye surgery, I don't like to look at these small little buttons, and I'm trying to learn what each one is. So right here, and if you go over it, and I don't know if you know this already or if this is what you mean or not, but hopefully this helps some. But if, um, if you just raise your mouse over it, it says text. So I click that, and then you see over here on the right, it comes up where all your fonts, and let's just go with my... My favorite one is this Lavenderia that I don't even know if that's how you say it, but here it is here. So I'm going to go down. They have it in delicate, sturdy, and regular. So let's just go with sturdy. Um, so there's that. So then you have to, sometimes you have to make sure it's clicked and then see that red cursor. Hopefully you can see that on the screen. So um, let's just go ahead and type mail. So let's do actually... Um, Where's my, there we go. So where's my capital? So there's Mel. Let's make it, um, let's click it. How do I do that? Forget. No, nope. see I'm messing with stuff. There we go. Then we make it bigger. So there's the bigger so you can see it. So hopefully that's what you mean. Um, and maybe then you can just click that. And just remember when you click this, you have to click over here to get your cursor there. And then it'll, you know, you choose what font and your list of fonts. And I got a lot of these for free and some are the basic ones on there. Um, and then you can go, you know, go further that way. And I even go in here, and I this is a little paint bucket. And let me click this. And then I just, um, you know, choose the color. And then you can even go the next route. And where is it? Um, see, like, this is how bad I am. Like, in between using it, I forget which one is which. Um, here we go. I think it's offset. So you do the offset, and then that gives it, and you just have to, I think you weld it. Where's the weld? Is this the weld one? There's the weld. You just click weld, and then that's welded together. And then let's do, I don't know if that's going to change the whole color. Let's go back to our paint bucket. Um, let's do a color you can see better blue so yeah so see you can kind of play around and then that way you can choose and see if you even like that color or if you want to make the offset smaller where it's not such a shadow but hopefully that helps and maybe that's what you mean where you have to hit on the screen here how to get it so just go over here click the text and then make sure you click on your mat and then you should start typing it should pick up your specific font that you chose so Again, just click over here, go there. Let me know if this is what you mean and if that helped, and we'll go from there. And um, hopefully, you know, even if you're not Tiffany watching, maybe this will help somebody else as well. So let me know, and um, if this isn't what you meant, I'll try to research it more for you. All right, talk to you soon. Bye.